Hello students, how are you all? Your favorite YouTube channel Rastivdhar is back with another interesting science video which is based on class 6 science chapter separation of substances. So in this video, we will discuss some simple methods of separating substances that are mixed together. There are many instances when we notice a substance being separated from a mixture of materials. Tea leaves are separated from the liquid with a strainer while preparing tea. Similarly, you might have eaten salted dahlia or poha. If you found that it had chilies in it, you may have carefully taken them out before eating. We see that before we use a substance, we need to separate harmful or non-useful substances that may be mixed with it. Sometimes we separate even useful components if we need to use them separately. The substances to be separated may be particles of different sizes or materials. These may be solids, liquids or even gaseous. So how do we separate substances mixed together if they have so many different properties? We will get the answer of this by discussing some simple methods which are used to separate different substances that are mixed together. We may have come across some of these methods being used in day-to-day -day activities like handpicking, threshing, winnowing, sieving, sedimentation, decantation, filtration and evaporation. So in this video, you will get the knowledge about handpicking, threshing, winnowing and sieving and the rest of the methods we will discuss in the upcoming video. Hand picking can be used for separating slightly larger sized impurities like the pieces of dirt, stone and husk from wheat, rice or pulses. The quantity of such impurities is usually not very large. In such situation, we find that hand picking is a convenient method of separating substances. The process that is used to separate grain from stalk etc is called threshing. In this process, the stalks are beaten to free the grain seeds. Sometimes, threshing is done with the help of bullocks. The method of separating components of a mixture is called winnowing. Winnowing is used to separate heavier and lighter components of a mixture by wind or by blowing air. Sieving is the process which allows the fine floor particles to pass through the holes of the sieve while the bigger impurities remain on the sieve. Sieving is used when components of a mixture have different sizes. 